Uh, my name is Eric Baez. I am a co-producer here at Monday Night Comedy at The Turf. I'm going to be your host tonight, your friendly neighborhood, Eric Baez. Yeah, that's a self-validation. Fantastic. It is a Monday night comedy show we run weekly at The Turf, which is downtown on First Street and Pierce. For those of you guys that don't know what the show is, uh, this is a chance for local comics to come up here and uh, work out some of their material. They get some uh, time to brush up on some new stuff, uh, polish old stuff that they take to bigger shows, and it's also a chance for comics that have never done comedy get a chance to try it out on a bar on Monday night. I started comedy about uh, three years, actually almost four years ago now. I took a note from a, a actual like, very well-known comedian. He said, if, it, uh, if you're into something and you're passionate about it, you need to have those immersion years where you surround yourself with it as much as you can. People don't know, but there's a bone in your shoulder. When you're as thin as me, it hurts the people that you love. Like that's. I did it for about six months. I actually got a job at Stand Up Live, trying to learn as much as I could, uh, as like often as I could. And I thought, what better way to do that than get a job at a comedy club? I love learning about history, and uh, I'm very fascinated by the pyramids. And what we learned about the pyramids is that the Egyptians enslaved the Jews to build the pyramids. But I think there's more to that story. I think that the Egyptians got like five Jews together, and they were like, okay, if you five Jews get five more Jews, and those five Jews get five more Jews. <laughs> My advice as being a show producer and as a comic myself to younger comedians, young comedians just, you know, if you're going to do a show, you booked it, be on time, uh, be mindful, uh, that's about it. It's almost like wrangling kids in a daycare. You got 20 different people that want to do different things at the same time and they all want their spot and they all want their attention. Midwest is, is a good place to grow up. We got something back in the Midwest that they don't have out here. It's called a, um, what's that, a work ethic. And, uh, I'm sorry you saw no where the magic happens. I have to get my sheets clean. Get out of my house.